what is up everyone welcome back to the channel yeltsin here so we are going to continue with the wine picking up exactly where we left off last episode definitely hope you guys are enjoying this i definitely am anyway if you are please be sure to hit that like button let's go ahead and get back to it also that headless dude was a different dude the guy that was shooting at me he had a gun or a, a head and a hat Here we go. Oh, I see. All right, so can't pick that up. And I have to run really fast to get over there. And if I do that, I can actually get up here. So. A little too far? A little too f Oh, wait. Oh, hey. Um. Stairs here. Drop that there. I don't know if that's going to be enough. Just enough. Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Alright, what do we got? We got another block here. Drop that there. I saw some more stuff down here, so let's take this out. Son of a bitch. Take this out. Damn it. I don't really know why we need three of these now. I'll go ahead and drop this here. Oh. Damn it. So we need it to tip up so that we can actually jump across. So that's what we need. So we... Alright, dude. Dry to breath. Settle down. Settle down. Damn it. Alright, so let's grab this one. Alright, so we'll see if that actually keeps it up. There we go. There we go. All right, I'm out of breath. Now, I'm not going to be able to jump across there. Are you shitting me? All right, so... Let's go along here. Crouch. Mm-mm. wish I could like lean around the corner all right so there's nothing there okay let's keep going oh my god well this is different come on come on come on come on oh no I'm out of breath get the fuck up there Screw you, asshole. All right, let's go up. I feel like down. I feel like down. Oh, that's where we're, okay, that's where we came from. So I don't feel like down. I feel like up. He runs out of breath so quick. I like this whole like time warp thing or or space time continuum nonsense <sighs> <laughs> Shit. 
shit. All right. I don't know. Might have should have gone to check it out first, but let's follow. And we never did go over there. We probably should do that, actually. Probably should have done that before. Live and learn. Cart's still going. So I guess I'm cut off from that area for now. I don't know if I'll be able to go back. I honestly, I don't know the purpose. So I'm wondering if I needed to... It's getting dark, so I can barely see. Oh, stairs. There we go. So what I probably need to do is send that thing back. When it gets close, I need to get on it, ride it over there. Okay, that's what we gotta do. We're not gonna get in front of the thing because I feel like it's probably gonna kill me. pretty dark in here all right come on a little further buddy a little further no don't run out of breath you little fucker. come on come on oh nice wish I could turn the lights on Kidding me? <sighs> Left or right? I'm right handed, let's go right. Shut your little rat mouth. Okay, so this is a beautiful man. All right, can't jump over. I see a red sign there. So I think we do definitely need to go get back down there at some point. I also have a feeling that we're going to be chased here in a moment, shot at, scared. Oh, that's cool. Looks like a door. Looks like a door. Hell. Yeah. All right. Uh, let's give me a gun. Mother and father, school essay. 
Mother and father are two gigantic statues you can see from almost every part of the capital where we live. Mother is at the top of the highest peak of the other side of the bay, and father stands at the place where almost everybody works. The Banny Winery. My father works for them too, as a servant. No one knows who built these statues, but they let the Banny build their winery below father because they were so nice to everyone. Whenever someone here is sad or crying, they usually go up to visit mother. Mother is good. Helps people with, helps people who come to her feel better. Father is good too. He helps the banny and all us. He helps the ban, he helps the banny and all of us to make the best wine in the whole wide world. Okay, it's a weird little cult we got going on. Can hear those rats skittering around. That's something. Before we go that way, though, I want to go down. Downstairs. I guess we can't shut doors. Okay, this leads us out. That's where we want to go. Son of a bitch. Down again? Wait, have we... Have we been here? Yeah, okay. So now, though, we can actually... We were just able to get through that door. Don't want to go there yet because I want to go upstairs because I feel like I did see a, le a lever lever uh, out here. So let's go. Let's go take care of that. I don't know what these symbols are. Check the drawers. Nothing. Do we go down first? Yeah, there's a wine bottle over there. Empty. What? Special wine bottle found. Except I can't get to it. No, no, I can't get to it. Damn it. And it's blocked up. It's inside there. Damn it. I want that wine bottle. Okay, so I think we should go out first. Down and out. Locked. Okay, I, we may need it unlocked at some point, so maybe we'll find another key. <clears throat> Notice to anyone founding helping members of the Banny family to flee. Interesting. Any and all who are found helping members of the Banny family or their employees will be placed in quarantine in the cell for five months. We urge, we urge all not to accept bribes from members of the family since they all have been infected with the devil's fevers and constitute a serious health danger. All tunnels and underground accesses to the winery, private cellars, and the farmhouse have been sealed off and are monitored by the authorities. Any family member by the last name Banny found by the authorities outside their mansion will first have their belongings confiscated and burned then be escorted back to the mansion 
Ooh, shit's getting real. We are sad to hear the news that the little Leia has passed away from, and the government sends our sincerest condolences. However, the fact that her death from the devil's fevers were, was kept a secret from us for weeks was a despicable act on the part of the, your family. Therefore, you and your entire family will be forced to be forced in confinement indefinitely without any contact with the outside world until further notice. This breaks my heart. But the situation caused by the devil's fevers is spinning out of control. Because of your fine reputation and how dear you all are to everyone on this island, we will give you the privilege of stocking up on supplies one last time. Speak with the four young men we speak with the four young men we assigned to you about this matter. After this last job, you they will no longer be helping you. After this last job, they will no longer be helping you. Okay. Due to uncontrollable infections related to the devil's fevers appearing among your employees as governor, I am forced to confine your entire family and temporarily temporarily put a stop to any winemaking activity until further notice effective immediately you have been assigned four military guards who will be your link to the outside world and take care of your purchases and other necessary errands we hope that little Leia's health improves i think i'm reading these out of order for the attention of the most honorable mr banny it has come to our attention that several of our, your employees have been infected with what some are calling the devil's fevers for your own safety, we recommend that you isolate and dismiss these filthy and irresponsible persons and that under no circumstances you or the members of your family are to leave your mansion. Who knows what sort of low-class immigrants they have been spending their free time with. Additionally, your granddaughter Leia has been noticeably absent from classes for some days now. We hope she is well. Without wanting to cause offense, I remind you that if you or someone in your family is experiencing fever, you should inform the authorities of for your own fair welfare to the banny family and their employees as you well know there's a strange fever ravaging the nearby areas that border your mansion for your own safety we urge you not to leave your property at any time until all of this has passed with the notice we have no intention of accusing you of anything it is well known that the fever originated in the poor neighborhood where idle immigrants live and vomit inducing conditions I give you my word as governor that when these fevers have passed and everything is cleared up, that those vagrant illegals will receive their punishment. You know how important your winery is for the island's economy, so please excuse me for suggesting that you stay in your mansion, cut off from contact with the world outside. But believe me, I recommend this for your own health and well-being. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure I am reading these things out of order. Alright, I just want to come down here. Uh, this is probably locked. Yeah. Uh, rewards for the killing of any... Rewards for the killing of any banny. Wow. Bounty offered to any citizen who hunts down members of the banny family. The reward will be doubled for children and triple if the dishonorable Mr. Banny is captured alive. They should preferably kill... Wow. They should preferably be killed with a weapon which does not cause them to bleed. If a rifle is necessary, avoid shooting the head or arteries, which may cause pools of blood to form. We remind you that leaving one's res residence during quarantine hours is still prohibited, still prohibited, and everyone must take extreme precautions to combat the devil's fevers. We all know that the banny did, but that we all know what the banny did, but that does not mean the rest of us as citizens have a free pass to ignore quarantine just to hunt them down. Holy shit. They did some real bad stuff. Okay, here's the red one. Wine and grapes. I thought we saw another one. Yeah, it's up there. Alright. Alright, so I think we're not... I don't think we're going to be able to go in down here. Uh, what's this? Alright, we have the... What are they called? The coffer? No. Maybe it's just a vase. I thought I was thinking it were a fancy word. And the wine bottle. Okay, so wine, uh, uh, the the vase, and wine bottle. 
What was this again? Wine, glass, and grapes. Okay. Alright, so now I guess we do have to go upstairs. This dude needs to work out. Who am I kidding? I don't work out either. Alright, so across we go. All right, closed. Oh. All right, there's one out here. Okay, so we have five of them. Okay, so we have the wine bottle and that. We have this. I yeah, I think it was that. We have this. In the cork we have this was it this I think we're missing one hell yeah I uh, don't know where that last one was but oh wait <laughs> okay here we go here we go Achievement unlocked. The tasting completed. When the ground underneath your feet cracks. You fall on the debris and are knocked unconscious. Slowly you begin to wake up. It is night now. You remember someone dressed in black who came near you and locked you in the room. You're unsure if it was real or a dream. Your eyes slowly adapt to the light. And you wake up with a terrible headache. Little by little your vision gets less blurry. Want more immersion? You can take off the interface and visual aids in the accessibility menu. And we're going to go ahead and end it here for now. Loving this game. Beautiful, creepy. It's getting better, getting more creepy. Anyway, if you guys have any questions or comments, feel free to go ahead and drop them below. Otherwise, we'll see you in the next episode.